But go on, you, you know the problem with Sakura and Naruto? That imagine if you put Sakura as the main character but turned her into a guy, and every time he's like, I'm gonna start doing this, he immediately falls back a step and is like goes back to his old ways and, and he's like, never like punished for no. any of the stuff. Oh, and he, he that's that's, really that's cool. his entire personality. Is that's that he will do that for the entire show. That's so cool. No, it's still there unfortunately. Alright. Looks like we're getting Robin versus Bayonetta. This a very like, unlikely matchup to see anywhere, honestly. This is what I love about Ultimate. You have all these like weird, irrelevant character matchups like this one that you really only get like vocals and stuff. So it's kind of a magic that the game has, but like if you ask me, oh who wins this, like I have no <laughs> idea. Oh. If I had to give it to either character, I'd probably give it to Bayonetta. Just because Bayonetta doesn't necessarily struggle the same way that Robin does. Oh. In which the... Oh. Nice zero to death. quick zero to death, yeah. Oh. Oh, there we go. And right back. He should be. Never mind. Yeah. I forgot that Robin's recovery is actually not bad until she loses the L win. Yeah. Ooh. Sometimes I even forget that it has a limit. Like, I think it only lost the limit for I think the amount for it once I think her and uh, hero are the only two characters with the limit on the rub B mm -hmm. which is oh wait wait no there's Rob too oh yeah wow Ow. okay right. oh that was a really good witch time feel like, yeah, I would probably return back to ledge because he has to do the exact same thing. You can edge guard him a lot better out there. Yeah, I always forget, like, how, like, Bayo, how far she can actually go and make it back like nothing. Tries to bait out another option with Witch Time. Oh. And regardless, you're oh, going to get geez. hit with that move. What you want to do is jump away uh, if you ever see a Robin start to down smash. If you're stuck at ledge, what you can do is just simply jump over it, like retreating, jump over. Because the hitbox isn't going to hit you because it's not that big, necessarily above her. Alright, and a good up smash secures the second stock for Tibbers. Alright, currently up at the right lead back. and immediately <laughs> right back. Right at him, jeez. Even games, like nothing happened. Yep. Alright. Out of all the characters they could have gone, the, they went these two. Probably two of the... I won't say low tiers because I don't think Bayonetta's a low tier, but I, I definitely like think Robin right? Mid-tier, probably at best. Yeah, because like she can still do like dumb combos like that and stuff. Obviously, it's not as good as it was in Smash 4, but... Alright, a good back air. And... Oh. There? Okay. I'm surprised he didn't try to witch time the arc fire there. He probably could have gotten the stock off of that. Oh, and sniped. Bayonetta is saying, This is my hood. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to take off my headset because I feel like the noise is about to switch. Oh. Well, now the voices in my head are gone because I took the thing off. That's a really good setup for a tournament. Yeah, we got a whole like comic. Do they? They have their own room, right? Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, it's just not plugged in. Legit, it's like way bigger than I expected. Yeah, it's it. It doesn't have AC in Did there. Did I know that though? I don't know. Did you I like that? Really you like how it's right back? For a little yeah. bit. It's it's in this room. I, I might. No, dude, that shit was clean though. Uh, I have to keep my camera. Can you hear you? I'm not gonna lie. That shit scared the fuck out of me. And I was like, okay, if I don't keep my composure, I'm gonna lose my momentum. That's exactly what happened. And we also don't have honestly kids here, which is always positive. Yep. Good. Completely. Oh, yeah. Thank you. 
You're kind of down behind. I was. Yeah, and I noticed that you were. Because I thought you dropped your shield and it blew up his mind. Yeah. Okay. You take the stitch. Alright, let's go. Hello, Bastion. Hello, Bastion, okay. Oh, so okay. I'm feeling the Saurus switch just from Hollow Bastion. Yeah. And I don't necessarily think he's going to want to blow out Kazuya against Bayonetta. Because I don't think that's a great matchup. Oh, or never mind. Oh, oh, Kazuya, okay. He's just going to do it. I was expecting Sora, dude. He's like home turf, yeah. home music, you know. It's like powering up the power of friendship, dude. He does what Bayonetta does, but better. Yeah. And with a sword. And Disney magic. That's the most important part. That that little keychain, that's the most expensive Three, thing in the whole game. Two, one, go. All right. Game number two. Bayo is trying to come up first. Right. Wow, the fact that one of these players isn't going to continue on to the tournament is actually kind of insane to me. Both of these players are really good. Okay. It's not gonna be able to get it off of there. Oh no, you do not want to challenge that. Okay, much better. That's the thing with Kazuya's moves. A good chunk of them make his entire upper body like completely intangible. Okay. Ooh, nah, you're gonna lose the stock right there for that. Never mind. Incredibly good DI. If anything, I probably would have ended my combo a lot earlier and gone for the uh, suicide stike, suicide stock with Bayonetta like, like that. that. <laughs> I love, but she can still make it back. No yeah. Problem. With Bayonetta, it's actually optimal to go for it. Okay. Tipper is currently on his tournament stock. Winner of the last tournament here. You know what happens to the best of us, though? Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. What are you doing, Sim? If you're trying to bait out an option, oh. don't go for that. Interesting. He was able to interrupt the uh, spin go kick. Oh, oh my oh. god! Alright, with that, Symbiote is going to take a 2-0 over Tibbers. Very clean ending right there. Very nice. You 